Puzzles and riddles are amazing. They're not just fun and entertaining, but also a good way to exercise your brain. Today we're going to take a look in one of the variations of the hats riddles, more specifically, the four hats riddle. This riddle starts with four prisoners, let's call them Darren, Clive, Brian and Alan, who were sentenced to death. However, they were given a chance to live. So they were buried to their necks and each one received a hat, black or white, in this order. Alan and Brian can only see their sides of the brick wall. Clive can see Brian and Darren can see Brian and Clive. They know that between them are four hats, two black and two white, but they don't know which color they are wearing. They are not allowed to talk to one another and there are no outside influences or other ways of communicating. After 30 minutes, the executioner tells them that one person must call out the color of his hat. If one of them get it right, they're all free. The riddle is, who is certain about the color of their own hat? Let's take a look into the possibilities. For Brian and Alan, there's nothing they can do, because they only see the wall in front of them, so they have no clue about the hats. Now, for Clive, he's able to see Brian's hat, so in his perspective, there are three possible combinations, so he's not certain about his own hat. Darren can see two hats, so he can think of two possible solutions, but the thing is, he's not sure about the color of his hat also. So, if we look into the possibilities, there's no solution, because no one can tell for sure what's the color of their own hat. But I tell you that there is a solution for this riddle, where one of them can call out the color of his hat with 100% certainty and it's based on induction. So I invite you to pause the video right now before I give you the solution. Okay, so let's think about the other possible layouts on this problem. If Clive and Brian were using hats with the same color, let's say white, Darren would instantly know that his hat was black because they know that there are two blacks and two whites. The same thing would happen if Clive's and Brian's hats were black. Now, remember the possible combinations Clive thought about? He also knows that if Darren happens to see two hats of the same color in front of him, he would say something. But because he didn't, Clive knows that Darren is looking at two hats with different colors. So he would rule out this last possibility and would be sure that his hat was black, saving everyone. I hope this riddle made you think a little bit outside the box and also to see the importance of induction in some problems. I also hope you had fun and to see you in the next video. Bye!